So with FC25 only a few weeks away, I thought I'd show you, or at least tell you, how to transfer the points over to FC25, because it has been confirmed that you can transfer any points that you have either left over or want to stock up for next I say next year, but the next installment of the game. So, obviously, a lot of people do normally like a one transaction. It tends to be what I try and do. Um, I normally load up a few points before. To be to be fair, you can obviously uh, buy points on the new release, but it is nice if you have already got it done, basically. So, the way that you want to do it is obviously pick what you want. You can see that they've now added the 18 and a half option, which is just nuts in itself. But that's going to be in the new game, so they've added it this time around. So, hopefully, they could probably catch any more sales going on for this year. But then also, you can transfer it a little bit easier for the next time. So all you do is load up what you need from these points. Um, it will it will take everything. It doesn't have to be an even amount. It can be whatever. So you could literally get 10, 1,050 and be absolutely fine with that. And then as soon as you load up on FC25, you will get prompted the first time you go into Ultimate Team if you would like to transfer these points over. Now, it's very, very important that you read it and you do transfer them over because if you, for whatever reason, don't look at it and, and say no, you will never be able to transfer them over. You have to spend them in FC24. So if you don't want to take that risk, then obviously load up in FC25. But it is a pretty big prompt. There's like a couple of are you sure? So make sure that you are clicking it. It happens every single year. It is the very first time that you load the game up it will ask you straight away once you get past all of the uh, kind of uh, starter stuff with the starter kit and badges you will then be prompted straight away to take over your fc24 points into fc25 so load up what you can or what you need and have a good time with it i don't think the prices should change from now so they should all be the same but the addition was the 18 and a half which has been added into this game to be honest i didn't even know that so that's at least a good thing i suppose if you wanted to actually get a few amounts of points, really. But that's going to be everything. Let me know if you are getting any points to cross over. And I'll catch you all for the next one. Check out this sponsor, though. If you're looking for FC25 coins, Loot Bar have started their first subscription service. You can go onto their website and subscribe for FC25 coins. And with this, you'll be sent an email that gives you an extra 5% off on your very first order. This is in addition to the 8% off coupon that is available on your one order to start with. Then from there, you have got Loot Bar being one of the cheapest in FC24 and then continuing to be one of the cheapest on the market for FC25. So with all that said and done, subscribe to Loot Bar now and enjoy 5% off discount when we get into FC25.